I turned my squelch up about five minutes ago and I didn't hear anything and then I heard beep, beep. So all I hear is dead silence and then beep, beep. Yeah, well that was me doing that because I know you just listening. I've been sitting here just eating the mail. Yeah, I was listening to the video gate I stopped a couple of minutes ago. Jeez, you know, it's a good thing my fucked up family don't hear any of these clowns or ever hear them talk. If they heard, then they would be dead. Well, you know, uh, one of them girls think their daddy was half a gangster, you know what I'm saying? But I kind of figure we know what happened to him, so he wants to follow his footsteps quick. God forbid you want to start World War Seven. tell him, say, yo, start your video games. We like to hear what you really hear. Forget about it. You'll be snorting even harder in all the transmissions. Yeah, you ran about dead. So what's going on, man? Chilling like the mad villain. How you doing? I'm all right, man. Just chilling out here, man. My brother went back to Florida today, so I talked to him while he was on his way out. How'd you fall? I'm not sure, but uh, I think I hear one of uh, your mutual friends out there, so I'm going to sit back quiet a second and see if any of your friends want to talk to you because, you know, I don't want to be the center of your attention, sir. I think he was keying up the same time as you, but before I think he tried to yell at you. So I'm gonna sit back quiet so I can see what happens. What are you gonna yell at me for? I don't wanna talk to him. He's talking to me, but I'm gonna talk to him for. put his voice changer on for that transmission. That's your old friend CK who swears up and down that uh, even you know he'd kill me. Well, he's just not an old friend, he's just an old guy, another person I used to talk to on the radio. But he was different from then, though. Who are you talking to? Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? Who's this? All right, well, I'm going to sit back and see if he feels like talking to an old friend or trying to act like he's a quarter of a man. i got to go make a cup of coffee anyway. I I'll be right back, sir. Glad you popped in tonight. Uh, Eric bouncing around with you or are you running solo? Yeah, well, I'm just running solo a little bit, man. I'm just jumping around, though. Hey, go ahead and do make your coffee, man. I'm just going to sit here and read the mail and finish playing my game. Till four, Roger. I'll, I'll let you know when I'm back if none of your old friends want to kick it with you. Okay, Richie Radio. So glad I can't be heard. I'm back. Oh, it's got to be mutual. So, like, if I wanted to talk to them or him or whoever, I would have called their name. But evidently, I don't want to really talk to nobody that's not on the same page I'm on. Even before I heard you back, even before I heard you come back on radio, 
myself, you know what I'm saying? I don't like this motherfucker. Just how, just how on how he do shit, like a fucking rat. The shit he's done out here, some coward ass bullshit. The shit he's done out here. I'll never respect that cocksucker. He's a fucking rat, snitch motherfucker, and he's a fucking imposter. Out here fucking perpetrating, he's a police. He get people locked up, and I, I don't respect you know, the hood. Street don't respect shit like that. The fucking streets don't respect a cocksucker like that. So you you know what it is. But I got no problem on, on your judgment. You know what I'm saying? It don't got nothing to do with one thing. Don't got nothing to do with the other and shit. Hey, hey, Nappy. Yeah. Please allow me to clarify for you, because you know, I don't want this bitch fucking spinning your brain. In a video gate, I said, in 1993, while I was an undercover cop, I hooked up with a coke whore for credibility, and I spiked a couple of bones, okay? Anything else that came out of his mouth, he can't back it up, substantiate it, or prove it. None of it. He's going by what I say. Yes, while I was an undercover, deep cover officer, yes. I did some things, but, you know, hey, that was 21 years ago, and I'm so glad I don't know any of these cats, because 21 years ago, Nap, I was a different person, so when push came to shove, cats like that, you know how I roll, I left them right where they stood. Oh, damn, bro. Hey, listen, I don't, I don't, I don't judge people on what they do, what they used to do, and what they do now. I judge a person on how they treat me. And you never disrespect me, and I'm not going to disrespect you. And, hey, Richie, you hear me? I hear you. We talk. We chew around, drew around, and everything. Hey, that's about it. That's very true, Nappy, but those little junkies over there on the Lower East Side, they were misled and mislaid by the big man. They got this misconception. He set me up in the apartment. Me and him know each other. We're friends. If they ever listen to big man's revelation, the four gates, we'll see what happened 90 days after I lit up my antenna that he got his friend, which I knew about it beforehand, to set me up to come downstairs to get a radio, which was the most screaming his base station around. And then he finally said, wow, I know that cat. I met no, Richie told you all along you knew me. Richie said there's one thing you're never going to forget. Then you listen to those four videos and you got to say, wow, wow. This guy painted the whole picture like he thought he knew somebody. He stood out here one night and told us all, I spoke to my people in Jersey. You've been in prison for the last 10 years. Well, you know, that gas station I used to taunt them on. They look like a fucking prison. So I'm just letting you know, you know, these clowns don't, don't know real men. These are new jacks on the airwave, new jacks up and coming in the world. They think they're all fucking cowboys. They're fucking wanksters. And they couldn't sit at the table with me or you. Or to get next to me or you, they would need to sit down and they couldn't pull that off. So we let them talk and talk and walk. I'm clear. Well, I had a thing to do. I had a thing to go in and fill their own book up. I don't even bother to, like, get involved. Let me turn this thing down. Oh, man, bitch, you didn't say nothing to me. All right there, Nappy. Um, I got a driver who just pulled up out in the corner there, so I'm, I'm going to run out right quick and check this guy's radio right quick. The video's rolling. You can feel free to conversate with them nitwits. But kindly, after they come off the key, let them know I'm not even near the radio, but I will be back. This is how the non-crackhead makes his money there, dig me? Whatever, 
gonna get into it. I'm back, but let don't let them know I'm back. Let them just rag on. Recording people and shit. 
How can I rat him out if he come out of his own mouth? I don't control his mouth. my career, my past, and my childhood. That's, you know, that's this guy's bent over. But you already squared off with him about that, so don't, don't even get into it with him. Just say, well, uh, uh, he never met you, he never did anything with him, he never ratted on you. He don't control your mouth. If it's your own mouth that got fucked up, it wasn't me spitting the words out. Yeah, Roger there, Nappy. You have a good night. I'll, I'll duke it out with this bitch, man. I'm so glad I never met a clown like this. But I did rat on him. Oh, I'm sorry. I control the words that comes out of his mouth. I press his mic, and I spit his lyrics, right? Ooh, I'm not the only cat with video gates. I'm just the only one with the right ones. Richie Radio, get them all. Roger, Roger, right on there, sir. You have yourself a blessed one. Happy Halloween. And in case I don't catch you, a happy Thanksgiving. But I think I'll talk to you before that. You know, you gotta admire a man who can flip a man over that he never met. <laughs> Woo, the king of New York, Richie Radio, the big dog, Gadda. Don't ever forget that. Don't ever forget that. All those fucking faggot ass fucking recordings. I made you turn the fuck up. Don't ever The big boss of New York, Richie Radio, a.k.a. the king of New York, Frank White, 150, pistol grip, 127, the baddest man in the five boroughs, got class. I have the holy bullshit out you, yo, and it ain't that fucking serious. You just get a smack, a pop, a tap, a pop, 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 a and I really hope it goes down on Brooklyn soil. You said that. That you bring this shit to the fucking precinct and all that you fucking...